Yo, 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 what up, YouTube? Yeah, it's your boy Daddy Easy here, iPod Driver Kaka, otherwise known as only use me, Tomahawks. And today I'm going to show you how to connect your Sony uh, Pulse headsets, wireless Pulse headsets, to your Xbox 360 Bluetooth wise, and to your Wii U console wired and Bluetooth. So I'm basically going to show you. Now, if y'all don't know what headsets I'm talking about, I'm talking about the Sony Pulse headsets, the one that gives you the pulsation on your head. <laughs> so, um,. It'd be these right here as you can see. So what you're gonna need is obviously your headset. You're gonna need the Bluetooth uh, receiver that they gave you with it because you're gonna be using that part right there. And you're gonna need the 3.5 millimeter headphone jack that came with it, um, everything on in one. So the first thing what you're gonna need to do is, um, as you can see, my Xbox 360 is playing right now. There's no sound because I muted the TV. So you can see that I have no sound going through and everything is just come through my headset so what you want to need to do is you want to take this part which is this right here and you want to take your cord right now and you want to just plug it directly inside as so plug it in just like that next thing you want to do after that is plug this into the back of your Xbox 360 best part to put it at is in the back instead of the front it just you have more room for the coil once it's inside the back. Now, here's another thing that you're gonna really need to get this to work. You need a high def TV. Now, the reason why I'm saying high def TV, you need any type of TV that gives you an output. And I'm not talking about using the RCA ports, the uh, red, white, yellow, green, and stuff like that, and not those points. You need something that's gonna run that output right there next to my USB drive. So what I'm gonna basically do is take this. Plug it in. Which my TV is gonna do with that. I'm gonna get my cable remote, my TV remote right here. I'm gonna just go to audio out and I'm gonna put it to fix. Now, now it's on fix. Let me just get my camera mounted up correctly so you'll be able to see what's happening on the screen. Here's my headsets. Now you see there's no sounds come through. Both hands is right here. And what I'm gonna do is power it on. If I can find the power on button. And you're gonna hear the sound go straight through. And you can hear it. Pulsation. Volume down. So wait for another one to come back on. The reason why I got my hands in front of the screen is so you can see that I'm holding it, nothing, playing the volume on the TV, nothing. And you can hear the bumping from my headsets. Now here's another good thing. As long as you got that connected to your TV, you can basically take your TV remote, as so, put it on cable, and listen to your cable or your TV wirelessly on your Sony headsets. Now you can hear everything that's happening right here. Now I'm gonna show you what to do with the Wii U. So now this is for people that does not have this TV and owns a Wii U console. This one is a little bit easier. I'm just going to pop it right there the game. And like I said before, as long as you got this already plugged in, it's automatically going to give you the sound once you got it plugged into your TV. Now, this is another way to do it Bluetooth wise. Um, just going to log in. But you hear everything's coming through my headset, it's not that loud. But now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna plug it completely out of my um, TV. Here's the cord right here, and I'm just gonna plug it directly into the tablet. So as you can see, here's my tablet right there. Plug it directly inside. And I'm just gonna start up Call of Duty real quick. 
so you can hear the sounds that's coming out of the headset. Turn the tablet volume up so the headsets can get the sound. Which the sound quality is going to be very low. It's going to be very low uh, when you get it because it's going directly Bluetooth wise. Um, but you get a pulsation. So if you don't want to run this wirelessly, Bluetooth wise, um, you'll be able to get a, a good sound out of it. But it's not going to have that loud, loud, loudness sound that you're all used to. Um, let me just start this up real quick. As you can see my, my things right here. So I'm just going to take the Bluetooth set out and I'm going to run it wired now. Now this actually sounds better wired. So I'm just going to plug it in right here. Just going to go right here. Go to multiplayer. Just waiting for it to load up. And you'll be able to hear it. Not so loud, but you'll still be able to hear it. You'll be able to hear me move the buttons up and down. Now, to let you know that it is being played through my headset, this is what it sounds like if I turn the volume up on my TV. Put in a mute. And there we go right there. And there we go right there. Now that's being wired completely into the Wii U console right there to the tablet right there. So that's how you use your Sony PlayStation headsets going directly into the Wii U and the Xbox 360 wired and Bluetooth. And I'll catch you guys on my next video. Peace and deuces.